Hi Taurus, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading for December. This is, um, you know, it's gonna. I've decided that I'm just gonna do them one right after another. I'm gonna do a segment. I'm gonna do another segment. I'm gonna do another segment. I'm really not gonna date them. It's for any time in December. Okay, so today is December first, so this could resonate anywhere from now until. Any time in December. This is for Taurus. But this reading may not be for you. We're going to see whatever comes up. Now this will be my second December reading so far. So you can feel free to check the other one as well. I'll put it at the end of the video. Keep in mind this is not a private reading. It may not be for you. I focus on love. We will see whatever comes up. I want to wish you all a happy holiday if you celebrate. I focus on love. <laughs> this is about commitment, happiness, and love. The Four of Wands. Commitment, happiness, engagement perhaps. This can also signify some sort of gathering if you are single. You know, you could meet somebody at a gathering. So make sure you get out there. If you get invited to go someplace, go. Either way, and it's a, it's a soulmate connection. Okay? And this is like wish a wish come true. This is 11-11, all right? 11-11. It's a wish. A wish could be coming true in December. Merry Christmas. It looks like it's been delayed for some time. Your wish fulfillment has been delayed. Somebody didn't communicate or something or they just it just didn't come in time or it didn't come before for a reason. There is always a reason why. Something has been delayed. You may be feeling a little restless because you've been waiting for this new door to open, right? Oh, but they're here. They're here. So they, this whoever it is that's been postponing their arrival, it looks like they're ready. They're ready. They're ready to offer some sort of love, whoever this person is. Somebody is probably done thinking and they're ready to make an offer to you or you're ready to make an offer, whichever it is. So it looks like they're ready. Somebody's ready. Afraid, though, to take that leap of faith. Perhaps maybe they've been afraid to, to take that leap for some reason. Maybe they were afraid of getting in a commitment or something because this is a... Uh, fear. It is fear. It's, it, it is also the delay as well. There's been a delay in this offer of love, right? Somebody didn't want to act foolishly. Wanted to make sure that they were ready. They wanted to make sure that they were ready. And that you were ready. Maybe they've been watching you and they wanted to make sure you were ready? I don't know. You may meet this person at some sort of celebration. Just saying, this is a celebration, this is a celebration. I just gotta, I gotta really reiterate that. Could be a Christmas party. Could be uh, anything. Anything where... There's people, you know, there's a bunch of people around and they're having fun or something like that. Um, not receiving your wish fulfillment. You haven't received, you know, because upright this is gifts and harvest. Somebody has been waiting to receive and I can see that. I can see the delays big time. Delays in happiness, which sucks, right? Oh, but there you are. <laughs> I love it. You're going you're going to be right in the middle of the reading. I love it. This is this is totally perfect. This tells me that you are ready. You're ready. You are grounded. You're being practical. You've worked really hard to get back to your self, you know? You're feeling stable, you're feeling secure, and you have a golden opportunity in your hand. 
somebody sees it. Somebody sees it. They see that you are abundant and that you are, have your shit together. Look at it. Oh, my God. Knight of Cups. Somebody's coming in with an offer of love. After they've delayed it, they have delayed it. God damn it. Excuse my language. They delayed it for a reason, though, because they weren't quite ready or they didn't think you were ready, one or the other. Either way, somebody is wanting to start a relationship with you. There was, they were, they're, they've healed. And they, they're, they, this is uh, the pain. And it's connected to you and them. Okay, because here's the man, here's the woman. There's the pain. And now I've healed. The Three of Swords reversed, I've healed. This was delayed because probably both people needed to heal. And forgive, because this is forgiveness, the Three of Swords. This is coming out of pain, you know? It's like you've done a lot of work. Like I said, you've done a lot of healing. Now the time is, is good because you're ready. It's clear, it's clear to me that you're ready. Um, it's like you've released the pain. You, you have released the pain. And you needed to release the pain before you could get this happiness, this commitment, right? That had to happen. Because you, can't, you don't want to bring pain into the new relationship, right? So you've released pain, you, and you've gotten yourself back. You've gotten right back into your own element. Somebody's been watching by the looks of things. I think somebody's been waiting. Because you look, this guy, Ace of Cups right here, and then we have the Three of Cups, and then we have Three of Cups both reversed right here. They didn't feel like you were ready. They didn't feel like you were ready. You were still crying. You were still um, holding on maybe to a third-party situation. You weren't able. They weren't able to give to you because you weren't ready. And I think that they've been watching. I really do. Now it's the right time for something new. Now is the time for something. This is divine timing to start a new new thing. Okay? It's something that you have been waiting for. You may be going from a water sign to a fire sign just saying, I don't know if this is a fire sign or what. But it looks as though you've done a lot of healing, you've done a lot of work, you've evolved. Now somebody, and it, or it could be a water sign coming in. It could be a water sign. I don't know. But it's a water sign or a fire sign by the looks of things. Could be either. But anyway, it looks as though you've done a lot of healing. These are both healing cards. Both of them. So you've done a lot of work. And now you're ready. You're ready. You've evolved. You've got to the other side. You're, you're stable. You're secure. You're grounded. You're right in your own element. And you've closed. This is closure. Nine is closure. You've closed that chapter of sadness. You have. You have. You've evolved. You've grown from it. You've healed from it. But you couldn't get your wish fulfillment, your golden opportunity, until you did heal. You had to heal before this offer could come in. Bottom line. Bottom line. Oh, boy. Because it's not fair. It's not fair to involve. And the universe knows that. It's really not fair to involve somebody else when you are still holding on to uh, your upset from the past. I don't know. Hopefully you can see that good enough. So I just want to check real quick. There we go. Somebody wasn't getting their wish fulfillment in love because they needed to heal. Bottom line. But it's coming now. Because happiness, contentment, and looks like commitment perhaps is coming. Somebody is coming with an offer of love. They've been watching and they've been waiting for you to be ready. They've been waiting. They've been watching you. They have been watching you. 
They probably saw you go through some pain, and maybe they were going through some pain too. I don't know. It just wasn't the right time, but I think it is now. Yeah, they couldn't communicate. Somebody couldn't communicate. They didn't, they could, this is lack of power, lack of truth. They couldn't communicate for some reason. Oh, the King of Swords reversed. Now this is a this is a person who is abusive. Hurts people. And reversed. In reverse. Upright he he doesn't, okay? In reverse, the King of Swords is a person who is usually verbally abusive for sure cold they th the you <laughs> I feel like, I mean, this is expectations not being met. The Three of Cups reversed. And this person didn't meet your expectations and really hurt you. And you were still being, dealing with that pain, really. And this person, you there was a person here who was really abusive and caused you a lot of hurt. This is, I want to talk about the future, please. Yes, this person did cause a lot of pain and hurt. And they're just explaining why this couldn't happen. Why you couldn't find this happiness. Because of the previous abuse. You needed to heal from that. Let's talk about over here. Let's talk about this new love, okay? We want to talk about the new love. Yes, we understand there's been some abuse. We've done a lot of healing. We're back in our element. We're ready. We're ready. And now somebody's coming in on their fiery steed. <laughs> oh, my God. Here comes this man on his... I mean, this is a noble man, a fire sign fire sign so I mean I don't know if it's a fire sign it could be any sign but we have somebody over here who took on an energy of abusiveness that you needed to heal from now we have somebody coming in to the rescue okay this is somebody who is noble this is a warrior this is a hero it is a hero he's being recognized for his heroic heroic acts okay you got a hero. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> I knew this was coming. I knew this was coming. I did. Like three days ago, I posted on Facebook, I need a hero or something like that. I need a hero by Bonnie Tyler. I posted on Facebook. Several people saw it. I posted my Facebook group. And then like a day later, I always play, post songs and then I delete them when I'm up. I go through and I delete posts and stuff every day part of my job right so anyway I deleted it and then today in the daily vibe the hero came up and then here we go here we go Taurus here's your hero that's funny that song came to me in the middle of the night and that's why I posted on Facebook or something like that that, it, that song came to me anyway your hero is arriving and he's a warrior okay mm hmm don't lose hope. Don't give up. Don't give up. He's coming. You may have lost hope. You may feel like your wish is never going to be granted. Right? This didn't work out because... But trust me, it was a blessing. It was a blessing that it didn't work out. You don't need to be with somebody who's abusive.
you probably feel like all this healing work was in vain and that you're never going to get your wish fulfillment. And this person sees that you're losing hope. Interesting. But they probably also see that you have released. Somebody has released. I'm not holding on. I'm not holding on to the past anymore. Somebody has given up on the... The door is closed. You guys have closed a door. And this person has taken their time coming in with an offer because they want... You know, you had to, you had to pass this test. You had to pass this test of healing. You had to take back your power that was taken from by this man, and you did. You have this per, or this person, this person stole your power and hurt you, and you had to get back to reality. You had to get yourself back, and that's why this was delayed and stalled. Your wish fulfillment has been delayed. No shit delay all over it's been delayed but it looks like this person is arriving now and it's been a long time coming could be a Taurus Virgo Capricorn this is turning away from a relationship or abundance you know this could be moving Lack of abundance, lack of harmony in, at home. But upright, this is a completion. This is a completion, okay? Of something that used to be abundant. This is a new beginning. This is a new beginning of unto of abundance it really is after letting go of something that was no longer abundant emperor reversed aries No longer trying to control the outcome. It's out of your control, and I think that you realize that. <laughs> I think there's a change in the family dynamics in which somebody is... is leaving... Releasing, letting go of a controlling, manipulative situation once and for all, for good. This chapter is closure completed. But this being in this situation impacted wish fulfillment for quite some time. It was like it was a really, something was out of control out of your control and maybe this person that was coming or is coming in to save you needed to move out of their situation maybe they needed to move and release to get go after but because I see that there's a there's two people here that are both healing so I think perhaps we're dealing with whoever this person that is coming in for you, who's been watching you and wanting to come, needed to break free as well and heal. Because this is lack of healing as well. So I think that both people that are coming together needed time to break free and heal. It's evident that's what this is. So these two people that are coming together now are both ready, perhaps? Yeah, because there's... No, no, no. Oh my God. 
So you definitely could be dealing, you're dealing with an Aries or a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, but, or a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We have them all because Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio is under there. But, so we have all the signs here, but we have somebody who was, oh, he doesn't look very happy, uh, dealing with a whole lot of responsibilities, you know, financial issues, work issues, um, home responsibilities, uh, all kinds of things. But it looks like he's persevered and now he's ready. Now he's heading out of wherever he's been and heading towards you. But this is a person who has been buried in responsibilities. Therefore, he couldn't make that offer. He couldn't make that offer because he was going through some sort of release of his own. Maybe he had to drop something. It looks like he did. He may have had to move and that cost some money and it cost some time and it cost some energy and you know, so he just didn't have time to make this offer. Interesting. It, yeah, it didn't it cause it would cause the delay. It did cause the delay. This person just couldn't head in your direction for some reason. <coughs> he just didn't have the mental strength to do so because of the overwhelming amount of responsibility that has been was put on him or her. I think it's a him. But it looks as though things were out of, things were a little chaotic, things were disorganized, and he had to get his abundance back. You know, he had to get, he, he needed to get grounded so that he could come and get you. Yeah, there was a lack of mental strength. And he may even have fear. Whoever this person is may have some fear. If wondering if he has enough to offer. Do I have enough to offer? Do I have enough? Do I have enough to offer? So this person is, is heading in your direction. I don't think he's running. I think he's a little fearful. He's a little fearful if he's good enough. Yes, he's good enough. You're good enough. And, but it's what you've been prepared, getting prepared for. You've both been getting prepared for this. Boarding. Okay, so it looks as though whatever it is that you have been waiting for is right, right, right in sight. And maybe you're going to take a new adventure with this person. That's what it looks like to me. You're about to start a whole new adventure. Go down a road you've never been down. Yes, burdens, responsibilities that need making a conscious change to drop responsibilities. This person that is coming into your life had was overwhelmed, and that's why this was delayed. And they saw that you needed to heal too. They probably saw that you were overwhelmed, so it was a mutual thing. It's really a perfect match, right, when you're both overwhelmed at the same time? Anyway, um, now there's, a, there's a, something that is being dropped, let go of, so that they can be free, because this is a card of personal freedom, breaking free, so that they can have that new beginning. It's a ten. It's reversed. That wherever they've been, whatever has held them back, is being dropped, so that they can have the new beginning. We have a new beginning here. We do, with the Temperance card and these two tens reversed. We do. We have a new beginning. We do because tens upright are completions. So we have a new beginning here, that has been. Delayed because of situations that were out of control. You know, they needed to get under control before these two people could get together. <clears throat> Fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, moving in a new direction. This is a card of transition. This is a card of transition as well. This is, you've been going through a transition. You're about to get to the other side. You're almost where you need to be. 
but somebody lost their focus and they just couldn't give it their energy because it was overwhelming. Somebody lost their focus and their concentration because they were involved with too much, too much responsibilities. They needed to focus on themselves. They had to. They had to. But maybe now they want to fight for you. I don't know what this is. This is wanting to... put in their two cents anyway you know I'm gonna get in this fight I'm gonna get in this fight I'm ready to to fight whoever else is in the picture you know and somebody has walked away from something responsibilities and perhaps home somebody had they had to leave so that they could come for you they had to leave somebody they had to leave a situation Somebody had to leave a situation so that they could come towards you. No doubt. And that's why it was delayed. They couldn't give you any solid offer until they were ready, until they broke free. I mean, that's what this is. Because they didn't want to come to you with no integrity. I mean, who wants a person with no integrity? If you come to me while you are in a relationship, then don't bother. And they know that. They know that you would not accept any unstable offer. They know that. So they had to break free. Somebody is in the process or they have just broken free from, it looks like a commitment of some sort. So that they can have a start with you. But there's a lot of healing still that needs to be done. There's a, this is like, it will lead to happiness, but it's, it is definitely delayed. But this is your perfect match, right? So delays are just a minor temporary setback, right? It, it, this is upright, this is happiness, extreme happiness, reversed, it's still happiness, it's just a little delayed because there's still some healing, and this is a card of love heals. You guys are going to help each other to finish this healing process. Now, this is, this person is coming to you because they have finally broken free from something. They have finally been able to walk away from probably a relationship that they needed to get out of for who knows what reason and that will get on that one when you talk to them but anyway now now they're uh, entering your life unexpectedly for you you're probably like you didn't see this one coming right you didn't see this one coming all of a sudden they're here and it's a perfect match it's a soulmate connection this person is not your usual type, like I always say with a lover's card. It's not your usual type. This person is not like the last one. It's not. And it's not the last one. This is somebody completely different than the last one. This is a choice. Okay? Do you, do you, are you open to healing with this person? Are you, are you done with the past? Are you ready to move forward? Because this can certainly lead to victory and success. Now, this person may have dark hair. Just saying, I just happened to see this guy. He may have dark hair. Whether it's a man or a woman, dark haired. Um, either way, this is a soulmate connection in which love will help each other heal. It's like you guys will be each other's best friend, soulmate. Um, Band-Aid. I keep seeing Band-Aid. You know what I mean? It's like... Look at the angel's wings. They're brought to you from an angel. An angel is doing this. I just happened to look her up and that's a mother. That's a mother. That's a father. So I don't know. I, I don't know. I You know, there's a... Or grandmother even. I don't know. This is a connection that is being brought to you from these angels. 
angel wings on angels wings anyway be prepared to perhaps run into somebody or connect with somebody that you didn't think would even be interested in you and here they are and there's an opportunity to heal even more with this person this person has just gotten out of a relationship by the looks of things and things have been chaotic and or unorganized and a little costly put it that way costly financially costly which caused the delay in this union but now now is the time now is the time for this new beginning to start this new chapter to let go of the past because this is the completion the biggest completion of them all which leads to that major new beginning you guys are about to start a major new chapter in your life a major new beginning one one phase of your life is over and you're about to start another one with a soulmate I know that you are I know that you are I'm positive for those of you that have done a lot of healing work you've got back to yourself for the most part there's still an element of pain here because there was a lot of abuse especially verbal and mental mental and verbal abuse so yeah it takes a long time to heal from that but this person is going to help you with that and you're going to help them so that's what I see for December I see that somebody is coming into your life unexpectedly and it might be a shock I feel like it's going to be a shock that it's you it's you. It's you. That's what I keep hearing. It's you. It's you. You know, I don't know who it is, but it's you. It's like it's you. Where it's you. You're you're it. You know what I mean? You're the one. So this person is ready to come fight this battle with you. That's what's gonna happen. You guys are not gonna be fighting the battle alone. I think that you're gonna find your your partner that's gonna put in effort to stand right beside you. Oh my God. I told you. I knew it. I did. I did. I knew it. I was positive. So, new love. You have a new love coming in. Absolutely. This person is nothing like the last one. Nothing. So, oh my God. Oh, I just opened up to this past life relationship you've known each other before like, yeah you have that's no joke you absolutely have so yeah you guys have an opportunity for new love stay optimistic don't give up there you go December are you ready this person is going to help you heal the rest of the way you've known them before looks like it's meant to be it's been delayed because they needed to get out of a relationship and you needed to heal now it's time to come together divine timing right here good luck